hey guys, I'm from the future, and I noticed while I was editing the video that I said things like, uh, eh, eh, and um a lot, so I wanted to apologize for that. I hope you guys can uh, get through it without, you know, it bothering you, and like I said, I'm sorry. I will try to get better at that. What's up, everybody? Um, I know it has been a long time since I went to the Orlando uh, Halo World Championships in 2018, um, but I feel like... Uh, I should go ahead and give you guys a face to face about my experience and how everything was, um, who I got to meet, uh, things like that. Um, so I'm going to just kind of start from the beginning and uh, if you guys want to stick around and listen to this story, uh, I met a lot of cool people and I'll uh, try to remember everything I can. So let's get started. Alright, so when I first got there I wasn't really sure where I was going and I was looking around and I couldn't find anything. I saw this dude with curly hair. and. Uh, I noticed that it looked like he was wearing a jersey, so I started following him, because I figured, you know, of course he was going to be playing in the tournament, and uh, as I started following him and getting a little bit closer, I realized that it was actually Ryan Noob, uh, so I was kind of freaking out a little bit, but I didn't want to say anything to him, because I thought it would be a little creepy since I was like following behind him, you know, so I decided to move on, and uh, uh, I, I, th I said to myself that I would try to make sure to to talk to him when, uh, he had a chance. Um, next thing that happened was, is I walked up on, um, Snipe Down and, uh, McWin and all the guys from, uh, that team, I believe it was Spartan and, uh, I can't remember the other one. I always forget. I'm sorry, guys, but anyway, I walked up on all them, got nux from all them, um, and, uh, I got to talk to them for a second. That was really cool. Snipe Down is an interesting guy. Uh, he's, uh, he's kind of funny, and he's got a, he's got a real serious, uh, kind of face, you know? He's, he's, he's a cool guy. The next thing that happened was, is I was, uh, over, um, kind of by one of the, uh, gaming stations that everybody was playing on, and I noticed Proximity was playing over there. And al along with, um, Corpsick Coaching, I believe, and then, uh, Reclaimer was there, and, uh, oh man, what's, uh, what's his name? The other Chaotix member that's been playing with them re recently, um... Halo Master uh, 7, he was there, and um, so I uh, I asked Proximity and Reclaimer and Corpsic if I could get an interview with them, but I couldn't seem to find um, Halo Master 7, so I didn't get to get an interview with him, sadly, but um, they uh, they said, yeah, sure, man, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll catch you before we leave and everything, and just make sure, Proximity told me, he said, make sure you don't let, don't let me forget, because I might forget, and I was like, oh, it's all right, man, I'll, I'll make sure you don't forget. Funny thing is, he came up to me and reminded me because he had time to do it, so um, that's where those videos that came out for the interview, they're on my channel if you want to check them out. If you haven't seen them yet, I interviewed Proximity, Corpse, and Reclaimer. They're all in their own separate videos, and uh, they are they are great. Um, they're really cool. They're great guys. Um, you know, I, I'm really I'm really happy that I did get to meet them, um, and uh, and I'm hoping that um, I'll be able to play with them and get more. You know. Um, uh, time one-on-one -on -one time with them to uh, you know kind of help build my channel and also I, I really want to be friends with these guys they they seem like really good guys and you know I think they're super cool I'm, I'm sure most of you guys want to be friends with them and you know I mean who doesn't they're some of them I'm you know there's really really funny really cool guys you know so um, it was a really good experience overall I I, um, I don't know I really I'm really glad that I had the opportunity I'm really glad that I got to be a part of the first MLG Halo tournament in so long. It was the first one, and uh, it's super cool to me. I'm not going to forget that anytime soon. The last thing I want to talk about is um, I played in the free-for-all. Uh, I, I, when I started playing, I had been tanking, tanking, tanking Mountain Dew, trying to drink as much as I could. And uh, that was the worst idea because the whole time I was playing, I had to use the restroom quite badly. So it was not, you know, I wasn't playing as good as I could because we had to play, you know, too many rounds. And um, funny thing is, is the round I was, I was in second place um, for one of the rounds, which um, because of how well I did, I probably would have been able to move on. Uh, and the, the match got disconnected, so we had to restart. Um, very sad. 
Um, but I was playing against a, a professional named Obnoxious. I believe he's a professional. Uh, don't quote me on that because, you know, I, he might be kind of like semi-pro. But he, if he's not pro, he should be because he was really, really good. Also, there was a girl playing. She was very good, but I, she was sitting across from me, so I couldn't see her, uh, her name on the back of her shirt or anything. So... Yeah, um, I got I got to kind of like the the like the semi semi finals in the free for all, and then obnoxious and the girl that was playing uh, knocked me out. I believe the girl that was playing was one of the girls that were playing uh, against Proximity um, when they were doing their four v four tournament. So that's cool that I got to play against her. Um, it was fun. And guys, that's pretty much it. Other than the fact that you know I just sat down, watched some Halo. Um, I met some really cool people. Oh, there's one more thing. Um, I got to talk to Walshy, and that was the coolest thing ever. I love Walshy. I think he's hilarious. He's been a pro for so long. He's so many people's, like, top pro that have played in the past. You know, he's a legend. And, uh, I mean, I don't think, Walshy, I don't think you're watching this, but, um, if, uh, if you are, man, you are the best, and I don't know if you can remember me from the 2018 Orlando, but, um... You gave me Nux, and man, it made my day, like, straight up. Uh, I'm not going to forget any of these things that happened to me, and you're only going to get these kind of experiences going to a tournament like Halo um, run by MLG. Uh, it was an amazing experience. Um, the only complaint that I have is the fact that I was playing in the tournament, and I did not have anywhere to warm up or practice, and I didn't bring my Xbox. So going into the tournament, I hadn't played for, like, uh, two days. So it was completely ridiculous. But in the end, what can you do? It's not like I was going to win. So it was a great experience. It made me realize how much better people are at the game than me and how much I need to work to become better, um, which I've really been trying to do. So anyway, guys, I love you, and thank you so much for your time. If you stuck through to the end of this video, leave me a note and say I watched the whole thing or whatever you want to say. And uh, much love and... I will see you in the next one. Peace, guys.